Okay, you have this story. It's a sad story. It's a sad story. Do you Is that the only it? one you read? No, I've read like three. You have? Yeah. That's pretty good. All right, you had a really sweet one about your father. You read you you shared a list of uh, your dad had this list of. He wrote like this list of summations of movies in like a sentence. No, they were books. Oh, books. That's right. Books, not movies. He's like, I only saw the movies. <laughs> yeah. So they're like, no. Yeah. So then he had like, he wrote like a one sentence summary of every book that he read. Yeah. And he read like 73 novels. And he's a funny guy. He's funny. Yeah. Because yeah, he had MS. So he, you know, towards the end of his life, couldn't do much. So mm -hmm. the only thing he could do was read. And so he made like a list of all the classics and he read like 73 of the best classics. And then he wrote like one synopsis one funny line synopsis of each crime and punishment yeah what's that one russian decay among peasants rags alcohol and axe murdering <laughs> 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 i don't know how accurate that is i've never read crime yeah, and punishment, read but pretty <laughs> accurate makes it yeah. sound good <laughs> don quixote employer employee relationship tested by adventures <laughs> <laughs> Try to find Anna Karenina if you can. Anna oh, Karenina. I might, have, I might have passed it. Let me there see. There are a couple They're where he hated the book, and the the line is something like, "I just can't. I don't know how they." I don't even it. know how to read this. <laughs> Be careful what you wish, Ibaratskia for Ilovich. <laughs> <laughs> be careful what you and the, it's, it's like be careful what you name. wish for but he just like adds Russian the, <laughs> suffixes to the word <laughs> but think that, I think that's like one of the names in it um, then he did Shakespeare too he read all the Shakespeare plays twice wow yeah he's a pretty pretty <laughs> smart guy Hunchback of Notre Dame don't bring enchanted goats that can count to 15th century Paris <laughs> <laughs> Pride and Prejudice. Too bad there's no glass ceilings for Elizabeth to break. <laughs> <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> these, are, these are good read out loud, actually. Yeah, this is good. <coughs> Fantastic. And Kyle's dry witty yeah, voice. Yeah, you have a good reading style. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the Brothers Karamazov. Drunks, death, and decay. Typical Russian novel fare. <laughs> <laughs> I he tried to read that one. That's hard one. Too many names. Yeah, yeah everyone has like five names, and they're really complicated names. <laughs> Frankenstein. Monster fails to manage decomposition odor. <laughs> <laughs> really reduces it to its essence. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Dracula. Vampire advantage, immortality. Disadvantage, limited liquid diet. <laughs> That's great. Oh, he's brutal on uh, sense and sensibility. Mm. Yeah, I don't think he liked that one. The reader should have the sense and sensibility to avoid reading this inferior Austin work. <laughs> <laughs> wow. He could have been like a big book critic. Like, yeah. But the village people. We need the original lineup. Most of them are dead. <laughs> and uh, we need them to sing the national anthem every morning for the, for the health and safety of our children.